the suicide rate is disproportionately higher for those who are incarcerated among the general population. This is actually the first time we've done a suicide prevention walk inside of a prison in the whole country, believe it or not. Some of you have lost people to suicide and some of you have even made attempts. Suicide knows no race, it knows no age, gender, social status. It doesn't care if you're incarcerated or if you're a staff member or if you're a citizen of the community. You know, it unites us as people. A lot of us are walking next to people who we see every day. But the only difference of today is that on your wrist, you can notice what connection they have to that cause. The same cause. I'm wearing my bracelet for a villain. Strength. Strength means not giving up. I'm wearing a bracelet for my father who died by suicide. Uh, this one is faith, hope, and survivor. Survivor's for my sister because she tried to kill herself. Bracelets are for me. Let's start walking. I went through that stage when I first fell, but uh, I think that's what gave me some strength. You know, it's thinking about living for somebody else and not for my myself. I'm walking for a friend of mine named Tony. I'm trying to give Dylan and all the other people a voice that uh, don't have one, so that they, people know that they can talk to somebody and get support. My sister Shelly. Marcus. We all lost people. A lot of us, or some of us, to suicide. I'm walking yeah. for Seth Ramsey. We all have feelings. We all go through our own struggles. So, my wife, my wife's best friend. My father took his own life while he was incarcerated. I'm walking for my father and myself because I struggled with uh, those types of thoughts also. Because it takes courage to speak up. It takes courage to be emotionally vulnerable and let others see you for who you are and what you're experiencing in your life. Because that could be your loved one. That could be your friend. It could be a complete stranger. It takes courage to ask for help. I'm walking for my grandpa, Gary Maynard. It is very important that we talk about suicide because for far too long, we have kept our stories quiet we have kept our struggles quiet. Um, walking for my friend Beth. And we have stood in the darkness. I want to fight the fight. I want to fight against suicide. There's no place that we won't go to bring that message of hope. I want you to know that you can prevent suicide. There's no need to hide. There are no secrets. We can help those who are struggling. We can listen to those who have struggled, and we can also honor those that we, that we have lost. That's when we need to be strong and speak up. Everyone is important and has work. Don't feel like you're alone, because you're not. Ask for help. <laughs>